an extraordinary event occurred in Salzano in 1517. A priest was called with urgent haste to bring the viaticum to an invalid on the brink of death. The viaticum is the Eucharist to a person who is near the point of death. Today we would call this the sacrament of the sick. Fifty years ago it was known as extreme unction. Saint Ignatius of Loyola and his companions in 1536 paused in Venice and in the nearby cities while waiting their departure for the Holy Land. And in this way they had the opportunity to make the acquaintance of and personally evaluate the miracle that was described in a writing by the Jesuit servant of God, Simone Rodriguez. Here it is narrated about how a certain, quote, priest by the name of Lorenzo was called with urgency to administer the Holy Viaticum to the western confines of the parish to a mortibund ill person. The season and the hour were not suited for a procession, so the priest had to be satisfied with only one altar boy. Arriving at the meadows surrounding the Muson River, commonly called Kaim, several donkeys that were grazing, facing themselves in the direction of the pious convoy, and after approaching the priest, they bowed on their knees, and then followed the Most Holy Sacrament all the way to the home of the infirm, renewing the genuflection, and then, always with Father Lorenzo, they returned, stopping in the pasture. This news is repeated by the elders to the children and from the priests in the religious classes to the parishioners." Unquote. This miracle is proof that God has such respect for animals because they are one of God's creatures. This is our third donkey miracle in this video series and the seventh animal video. And they have involved fish, rabbits, two flocks of sheep, and a horse. A few years ago, there was a movie entitled All Dogs Go to Heaven in 1989, and then a sequel in 1996. I think it's really true. To quote Isaiah chapter 11, verses 6 through 9, The wolf will live with the lamb. The leopard will lie down with the goat. The calf and the lion and the yearling together. And a little child will lead them. The cow will feed with the bear. Their young will lie down together. And the lion will eat straw like the ox. The infant will play near the cobra's den, and the young child will put its hand into the viper's nest. They will neither harm nor destroy on all my holy mountain. For the earth will be filled with the knowledge of the Lord as the waters cover the sea.